When you sit down, focus on the breath. Become more aware of your body. And you'll notice there are some pains here and there. And sometimes in addition to the physical pain, there's a mental pain when you say, I don't like this. But don't stop there. See if the breath can help you. Because the Buddha doesn't have you just sit with pains. But he does say, watch out particularly for the pains in the mind, the, mind, the pains the mind is causing itself. And there are skillful and unskillful pains that you can cause yourself. The unskillful ones where you just complain about what you don't like. The skillful pains when you remind yourself, okay, there's work to do in the mind. I can't just sit here. I haven't gotten to the goal that I want. That thought, even though it does have some pain in it, is actually very useful because it encourages you to do something about it. You work with the breath to deal with the physical pain. You work with your mind, your attitudes in the mind to deal with the mental pains. Change the place where you're focused. Change your perception of the pain. Is the pain coming at you? Well, think of it going away. Do you think the pain has an intention to harm you? Well, remind yourself, the pain has no intention at all. And you find that once you take care of the mental side of the pain, then the physical pain is not all that bad. And even if you haven't solved the problem of the mental side of the pain, the fact that you're working on it, that can give you some sense of well-being. So the Buddha doesn't just have you watch pains come and go, or just sit with whatever is there. That attitude of just sitting with whatever is there is not one that he taught, not one that he encouraged. You have to realize that there are potentials coming up, and you want to look for the best potentials, and you want to develop the skills so you can do the best things with them. That way you can live in this human body and not have to suffer from it. You can live in this world and not have to suffer from the world. That's a skill really worth developing.